So as you guys know, we love JDM products. So an American-made company that's doing a JDM product release, we had to cover it. So this is a full breakdown of the brand new CX line from Sims. They're going younger, they're going more aggressive, and they're launching in Japan. So, so it's pretty hype. Yeah, so, and you've been wearing it. Yeah, and I've been loving it so far. So hopefully you guys enjoy the video. So let's get into it. Yeah, let's break it down. Welcome to the Hookup Tackle. The Hookup Tackle is the world's largest showcase of Mega Bass products, featuring baits and colors not found at any other dealer. The Hookup also offers a wide display of OSP, Evergreen, Depths, Lucky Craft, Jackal, and many more. The Hookup Tackle is owned and operated by family, is staffed by guides and verified tackle nerds who love helping anglers elevate their craft. If you're in the Phoenix area, we'd love to have you stop by our showroom and check out the wonderful world of Mega Bass and the hookup for yourself. If you shop online, there are almost 10,000 SKUs of Mega Bass products alone with hundreds of other companies and new products being added daily. So next time you're looking for that hard to find bait, that color your fish have never seen before, or maybe you just want to elevate your game, look at thehookuptackle.com. What's up, my friends? I am Ben Kohler with The Hookup Tackle, AKA The Tackle Otaku. My name is Jeffrey Hamilton. You guys can follow me at Jeffrey the King over here. And Why the King? Uh, I thought as a kid, the King was just such a cool tag. And, and now you're just such a badass, I'm, you're like, no, I'm a lame. Fuck it, I'm just gonna keep the <laughs> I need, King. I need to delete it. <laughs> it's overrated. So you can just call him The King, the peasant, apparently. The King, either one. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. yeah. Now that we've derailed this entire episode, <laughs> what are we going to talk about today, Jeff? Um, the King? Today we're going to be talking about the new Sim CX lineup that we kind of will be getting very soon. They're going to have two releases. They're going to have a spring and fall release. They're going to be bringing in, as you guys can already see, rain gear as well as hats, t-shirts, bags, vests, you name it. Even thermal socks that I wish I had when we were up in Wisconsin. Cause my feet are still recovering from that. Would have been nice to Would have, have been something really nice. warm <laughs> while we were there. But at least you got this the third yes, day. Yes, the last day. <laughs> right. So let's let's start with this because, you know, I'm I'm somebody that, like, dude, I've worn Sims since like I was a baby. Yeah. Right. And you're somebody that's kind of just getting into Sims, oh, yeah. so it's kind of fun to be sharing this excitement Experience. with yeah. you. I so. Mean, let me talk about the geeky specs yep. and then yep. you talk about like what it's actually <laughs> like to wear it yeah. because all of the samples came in medium sizes and as you can tell somebody lacks some height i'm not going to mention any names but only one of us fit in the medium so here's the scoop this is a brand new three-way stretch fabric what's nice about this is it's fully waterproof it's fully breathable just like pro dry but it's got built-in stretch everywhere, so yep. it completely moves with your body. So no longer do you have to buy an extra size just to make sure you have room to fish. You can actually have a suit that fits you to your size and it will move with you. It's got some really cool new features. It's got obviously the front zipper and it's got the storm pocket in the back. So even if water pushes through that waterproof zipper, it will drain and prevent you from getting wet inside it's got vertical hand warmer pockets on the sides it has these new horizontal chest pockets and these zippers are really amazing they are fully submergible so they will not get wet and they're self-healing so let me see if i can actually open one of these there we go all right so it's a fully self-healing zipper so what that means is if you're ever to pull it, like let's say your hands are cold or you get just a little aggressive on your zipper pull and you yanked it off, all you do is just push it back and re-pull it and it's totally healed. No more broken zippers, totally waterproof, which is amazing. A major plus, for Yeah, sure. big, big, big plus. And just super easy access to get to stuff. You can put your phone in there, whatever. It's got a beautiful three-way pull hood. So it's designed for speed. So they really designed these with bass boats in mind. So if you're going 60, 70 miles an hour down the lake, it's got the two pull cords on the front and then one in the rear. So you can really cinch it down. It's designed to sit right over your flat bill hat. So it's a perfect fit. Jeff's laughing because I wear flat bills and apparently I'm out of style now. Um, it also has some vent holes in the back. So if you're going 
I don't know. Maybe you guys are in an Allison. You're going 90 <laughs> miles an hour down the lake. No it has vent holes so that you, the hood's never going to rip off. It's yeah. just going to flow through, and you can ride with the hood the whole way. There's small little features like reflective coating for night fishing and that kind of stuff. But all in all, it's available in these two really clean patterns. But now, talk to us about actual usability in this thing, Jeff. Okay, so I got the suit when we were up in Wisconsin, and right away, I saw a huge difference from obviously just wearing regular three hoodies, you know, <laughs> <laughs> and, and two pairs right. of pants to where I would just slap this thing on. And there was a lot of brutal wind. If you guys have seen any of those Wisconsin videos, when we were out on the water, it would be calm for five minutes, then the next three hours, four hours, it's blowing 20, 30. And I was getting killed out there the first two days, but the final day using this actual suit, it's crazy going from not having like an actual good rain suit to having one to where you don't feel any type of wind at all where out there whether or not we were running to the next spot or if the wind was in front or to our backs i wasn't feeling any type of wind so my entire body as well as my legs were completely fine i didn't feel cold at all so that was such a huge benefit to me because when we're out there fishing, the slightest bit uncomfortable we get, it's gonna throw our game off. And so when we have the right gear to feel in the zone all the time and not think about the elements or how cold it is or how windy it is, we're gonna stay in tune with the actual fishing, which is super important. So wearing the suit for the past couple of weeks now, I've really fallen in love with just how breathable as well as it is. So early morning when it is 40 degrees here and it's blowing wind, I need it for to stay warm. But then when the sun comes up and maybe the wind dies down, it's still breathable enough to where I'm still wearing the entire suit. So it's cool that I don't really have to take off a bunch of layers and keep fishing. I can just wear this all day and feel pretty good. So like today, out on the water, it was literally like high 30s first thing. Yeah. And then it warmed up into like the upper 70s. Yeah. And did you feel any wind cutting across the lake at no. 65? No, I mean, fishing in Julius's boat, I'll never get over it. Going from my bass boat, that max speed is like 18, you, you kind of don't feel anything, to his running at you know, 55, 60, wind's hitting you. And I just remember sitting in his boat, I'm like, this is great. I don't feel any of this wind that's pounding down on us. So it's honestly such a big you know, improvement for my own you know, fishing abilities, where I'm not always cold 24 seven when right. I'm out there on the water. And then the other thing you talked about was the breathability. So like a big thing here in Arizona is a lot of times when you buy a set of rain gear that's too heavy, mm -hmm. it's one season yeah. worth of a suit. Like you can wear in the winter when it's freezing cold, yeah. <laughs> but when it gets to be like late spring and early summer, when we still have rainstorms mm -hmm. where you don't want to get wet because right. if you get wet, you freeze, but it still might be, you know, 85, 95, maybe even hundred degrees, like in the summer and oh, the yeah. monsoons. This is actually designed to breathe. Yep. It does have an internal fabric on the inside that's really soft to the touch. Mm -hmm. So you could even wear this with a short sleeve shirt yeah. or something that's not, you know, a thick layer piece and still be super comfortable oh, yeah. in this guy. So it's very light too, for, right. from what I expected. Because always hearing the guys about how heavy their rain suits were. When I got this and I put it on, I'm like, wow, this is actually pretty light. And like the way that the technology that went into actually making this is actually pretty good. I mean, I didn't think it would be able to, you know, have the wind literally bounce off of it at such high speeds. I literally thought I'd feel some of it, but honestly, even though it's not their highest, you know, grade of rain suit, it's still really, really good, especially with the new C C C3, C3, yeah. CPO, C3P, <laughs> C, C Flex 3. C, C, C what is it? <laughs> what the hell is this material called? C Flex 3. C Flex 3. I was going to see CV3 or CVS or something. CVS, yes. <laughs> oh, trademark. Trademark yeah. violation. Uh oh, I'm getting copyrighted. <laughs> but C Flex 3, the technology that went into it is actually better than I thought because, you know, everybody talks about Gore Tex this and Gore Tex that. So, so far, this is really good. Yeah. You know. Yeah. So, they've positioned this. If you guys are big Sims fans, they positioned this in between the Challenger suit, which is kind of their entry level rain suit, 
and the Pro Dry, which is you know the holy grail of rain suits that's gonna cost you 1200 bucks, right? So, you know, the Pro Dry is still the king of the hill. This guy was designed to be more affordable and much more aggressive in the styling. Yeah. And I think that's the big piece is the stretch material. It's so comfortable to fish in all day. Oh, I mean, yeah. You've been heaving swim baits and everything yeah. in this. Have you even, do you even notice it no. on at all? It feels just like a regular hoodie when you're throwing the big swim baits. I mean, when I'm throwing the swim baits, it's like all body movements and feeling with this and the flex, you actually feel it and it really doesn't feel like much. So I really like how it does have that flex in it when I'm throwing the swim baits. You don't really feel like you're wearing a heavy rain suit. Cool. You know? Cool. And it, it does have a bib. I know we've talked about, Jay, here, give me that jacket. Get him over here. So it does have a bib too. So both, you know, you can go with the camo or you can go with the black. And then a lot of the same features that you're used to seeing in the Pro Dry, you know, reinforcements in places that's important. It does have the, the other horizontal pockets on the leg. And again, that's the self-healing pocket. It's got the hand warmer pockets. It's got a storage pocket, reinforcement on the back side as well. So it comes as a whole suit. I think you guys are really going to like it. The two colorways right now, again, they're going for, you know, new mainstream, and cool and new. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. What the kids are into. But I, I'm into it. Mm. Does that mean I'm young, Jeff? Yeah. Okay, give you me this. Young. All right, what's next in the lineup, Jeff? We have a few hoodies, just classic style hoodies with a few different logos and designs on it. So that first one's got a swim bait on it with the Sims logo. And then you have just the regular Sims logo and the kind camo. Of, kind of matching that same camo pattern yeah. from the suit. If you guys haven't noticed, CX is kind of going with the camo pattern. Camo, black and some gray so and then this one i think this is our favorite one right yeah I, this is my favorite I think one this one's kind it's of kind sick. of a cool like uh Techno, I know, computerized, computerized 3D. cool large mouth yeah uh, i think so this one's rad i think it looks pretty dope so, so pretty straightforward sweatshirts this is going to be more fashion so oh, yeah. things that you could just lounge around in so yep. cool in this and then there is a rogue hoodie also is there still one of those over there yeah, so this is our number one selling hoodie in our store. This is the Rogue Fleece hoodie. It's a pretty amazing value in a technical fishing piece. $99 and you get a very highly wind resistant, highly water resistant jacket. So if you need windproof, waterproof, you go with the suit. But if you need a nice layering piece or for those days where you don't totally need you know, 100% windproof, waterproof. As it starts to warm up a little bit, this just makes an amazing jacket. Plus, it's a nice kind of, you know, straightforward fit. So you could wear this out to dinner and not look like a Boogan fisherman going out <laughs> to dinner, but it maintains the same colorway and the same cool, you know, kind of color pattern. So this will be available in the CX line as well. Yeah, this is actually a pretty rad jacket overall. I think this, yeah paired up with the actual rain suit would go hand in hand super well. Yeah, totally. I mean, really like the yeah. vibe. So I think, I think they knocked this out of the park. It's simple, yep. it's clean, they didn't overdo it. So I think you guys are gonna really like this piece. If you're not familiar with the Rogue Fleece, you should definitely check them out. As you can see, they're soft to the touch. It's basically just like a really nice soft shell jacket for 99 bucks, which is a great deal, yep. uh, especially for Sims quality jacket. Oh, yeah. So cool. And then what else we got? T-shirts here, I'll, di I'll ditch it over here. Okay, so then we just have your regular t-shirts as well. I mean, again, in some of those same patterns you guys saw in the hoodie, again, this 3D looking bass is still one of the coolest ones, I think, personally. Mm -hmm. Yep. So there's that one. And then all the t-shirts are $24.95. Yep. So good pricing on that. Yep, same same basic patterns coming from the hoodies. Yep. Yeah, same thing pretty cool. much, just in a t-shirt. And then there's that the sun shirt. tech tee. Okay, so we have the Pretty much the tech tees, the sun kind of shirts, really. Yeah. 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 Do you want me to take this one? I mean, if you sun want. Sun kind of shirt guy? Sun kind of shirt guy. Okay. So these are the Sims Solar Flex tech tees. No, they're not. Jesus Christ. What the f doing Solar, tech. Solar tech. Come on, dude. I, I know what I'm I know what I'm doing, Jeff. <laughs> it's just the sun. All right. So these are the Sims Solar tech tees. These are UPF 30. They are a polyester nylon blend, so they're incredibly soft to the touch. They feel that, just that real dreamy kind of feel to them. So Yeah, very silky. They, uh, what's nice about these is that they're $39.99, so it's at a, grace, grace? Grace. It's at a great price point. Two 
different patterns kind of staying with that whole camo hit you've got the camo bass and you have the camo logo down the front in the gray so just a great price point comfortable sun shirt complement the line and then there's also a few hats to complement the line here i'll give you a Thank couple you. and i'll take a couple so there's a couple of flat bills in there there's kind of the camo and the black with the logo hits on them and what do you got this is just the swim bait one camo trucker style and then as well as that 3d bass again all black yeah so everything just kind of carries through the whole line so you can be matchy matchy, matchy or you matchy. can be mix and matchy or you can just pick your favorite piece and rock it right right cool so what do you think overall as an assortment here with the cx line what what do you think about the direction and what what sims is going for here i mean from what i've known about sims they did have that trout fishing maybe older gentleman type of vibe to it now it seems like the new lineup that they're coming out with does try and modernize it to where it's you know more hip or cool or more fashionable because it seems like nowadays in social media a lot of guys just want to be fashionable and it's cool you know at the same time so camo you can't go wrong with black orange it's just classic sim stuff so i definitely like the way that it's going i can't wait to see how it evolves over time yeah you know? and i think what you're gonna love dude especially since you're a little bit newer to the sims line yeah is i think you you nailed it as far as like you know that they're definitely going fashion forward mm -hmm. but what's cool about sims is there are a gazillion fashion forward you know fishing t-shirt brands and oh, hat yeah. brand stuff but the functionality of sims gear when it's just shit outside yeah. is mind-blowing that's what i've uh, heard that you, you know? and you've you've been experiencing it yeah. <laughs> and Luckily so enough. you know i think this is a, a really nice blend of the two worlds of being you know very fashionable but so functional at the same time oh yeah it's, it's a great it's a great system so. i definitely like the way that it's going with that for yeah sure. yeah so Keep your eyes open. Right now, the CX line is slated for an early spring release. So depending on what happens with COVID and how things are shipped or, you know, possibly doing things right now, it's slated for a Japan drop in early spring. It's also slated as a Bassmaster Classic drop in early spring. So all of these products are available now on our website for pre-order. So if you want to make sure you get your order in, you certainly can. If you guys have any questions on the gear, you know, we're both going to be rocking it. So, you know, feel free to drop us questions in the comment section and either the king or myself can get uh, we'll can get, get back to, to you and we'll make sure that we get your, your questions answered. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Sweet. Easy as that. Okay. So, thank you guys for watching. We would love it if you would subscribe to our channel. Please See, do. you weren't even going to say that. You give me shit every I time that I was. don't say that. Okay. I 100% was. Because right. I respect it. I'll bet you your roommate, Mother Chase, you weren't going to say that. I win. Give it back to me then. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, thank you on behalf of myself and the king and the fly fishing guy over here that we've been making fun of. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, we appreciate it. Again, any questions you have, holler. We'll put links to all the pieces that we showed you today, uh, and we look forward to uh, seeing you guys rocking the new Sims CX gear. So until next time, peace, peace out. out.